Well, hello, Tiger, and welcome to the second trimester award ceremony. This is certainly a different way that we are going to celebrate you, but we want to be sure that you know that we appreciated all of your hard work and your dedication during second trimester. So we are here to celebrate you, and we're going to get started with Science Award. Our sixth grade Science Award recipient is Riley. Riley. Yeah, our seventh grade Science Award goes to Audie Curtis. And our eighth grade Science Award goes to Alex Carlshoy. Our next awards are for mathematics. The sixth grade math award goes to Corey Arden. The seventh grade math award is going to two people. The first one is Leslie Toledo. Hey, Leslie. And our second one is going to Kathy Vargas. Hey, Kathy. The eighth grade math award is going to Anjali Davis. Good job. The next awards we are going to celebrate are ELA. I have the sixth and eighth grade award, and these are for students who are class leaders. For sixth grade, it goes to Aiden Hughes. And for eighth grade, the award is for Vanessa Hitchens Curry. And I have the 7th grade ELA award, sorry for the awkward pause, um, and it goes to Kelsey Ole, and I have an extra little gift for her. You know, I waited up all night looking for the sun, I wondered where it went, and then it dawned on me. Hi, Kelsey. Ooh, that's a tough act to follow. We're going to go with social studies next. Would you like to go in reverse order this time? We can go in reverse order. Okay, for eighth grade social science, I the award goes to Autumn Jones. And I'm going to continue with the gifts. Um, we studied U.S. history, you know, and everybody knows where the big apple is. But do you know where the mini apple is? Boo. <laughs> We, we might have lost Mr. Dean Smith, so I'm going to we'll announce it, but we may have him come back and announce it again. It looks like for sixth grade, Sarah Jarvis got, oh, no, I'm oh, sorry, Eli Brady. Eli Brady has social studies in sixth grade, and in seventh grade, Jack Gertner. Nice job, Tiger. Way to go, Jack and Eli. And our next awards are for PE. For sixth grade, we have Miss Kelly Jarvis. For seventh grade, we have Carla. Carla. Yeah, no, thank you. And for eighth grade, we have Mr. Smart. These three students have always have uh, always have part of attitude out on the field or on the basketball court. And they're really great teammates with their classmates during group trips. So thank you guys. I hope to see you soon. And we get outside, so it's beautiful after that. Bye. And Mr. Lutz, will you present for middle school music? Absolutely. Hey, thank you. I have a, a sixth grade award winner is in our band, an outstanding trombone player. I'd like to recognize Bryce Easton. Way to go, Bryce. Um, our seventh grade winner in music is in both band and choir now that's the power of and and audrey wilson you are so outstanding on the stage the spotlight loves you and you are just doing such a wonderful job keep up the great work and our eighth grade winner is such a leader and a role model to um for music students and it's jocelyn robles she's an outstanding flute player and does a great job on the piano as well and we also, I enjoy seeing you in your leadership class, presenting at board meetings as well. Great job, Jocelyn. Keep up the work, good work, music students. Congratulations. Hi, Tigers. We're now going to go into the S2C Award. For uh, leadership in seventh grade, I decided this award to a person who shows that real leadership spirit and taking charge every morning with the speaker. And uh, for that reason, the award is going to Brian Holland. 
Good job, Ryan. And Spanish is up next. For Spanish, the word goes to Maddie Spanish, Joe Maddie. The eighth grade S2C, I chose Kaylee on the country for art. She always jumps at the chance to teach the younger students. She does a really good job. And I know she has younger siblings, so I just need to ask her, uh, where do you take someone when they get injured in a peekaboo accident? I see you! And for our PAWS award, which uh, at a lot of schools call a citizenship award, but our PAWS award really is just, uh, you know, students who demonstrate a good citizenship and, you know, they are exemplary models uh, students for their peers. In sixth grade, our uh, award recipient is Denise Yol. Who is Denise? Seventh grade is Kelsey Ulray. And eighth grade is Devin McFarland. So thank you, students, for being uh, model students. We had a really fun time sharing uh, this new award ceremony with you, and we are so proud of all the work you've been doing and all the work you are doing in our new distance learning middle schoolers. Keep up the great work, keep engaged, and keep doing great things and making us proud. We will see you really, really soon. Have a great day. <laughs>